It was a frightening night for the Ontario Hockey League and their team, the Niagara Ice Dogs, last night after their goalie was sent to hospital after a freak incident on the ice. A warning to our viewers that some of the visuals and details of this story are graphic and disturbing. The work of the on-ice staff and everyone in-house saved his life. Um, so it was really, there was a point in time last night where it was an option that he may have died on the ice due to loss of blood. Here goes Gruden. During Thursday night's game, a London Knights player collided with Ice Dogs goalie Tucker Tynan 40 seconds into the second period. The Knights player's skate blade managed to go under Tucker's goalie pad, cutting his right leg. Blood from his legs started to flow out, creating a pool on the ice. He had to be taken off the ice in a stretcher and was taken to hospital where he had to get emergency surgery. He's stable now, uh, thankfully. Um, you know, it's no longer uh, considered life-threatening, um, you know, which, which obviously is, is by far the most important thing. Um, you know, so at this point, um, you know, the femoral artery was not severed, um, you know, thankfully, which is great news. Um, and, and really at this point, it's the quad muscle was completely torn apart um, and ripped through by the skate blade. So certainly it will be, you know, a significant recovery process. Although it was a frightening and scary incident, the team doesn't believe it was because of a lack of equipment or safety precautions. It's just an unfortunate, obviously, casualty in a completely innocent hockey play, um, you know, that uh, that just resulted in, and, you know, is uh, extremely dangerous at times. Uh, but certainly, you know, I think the equipment and the safety is trending in the right direction. The team says a 17-year-old will be in hospital for at least another 24 hours. It's, you know, been a pretty traumatic uh, 14 hours for us here in Niagara. Um, you know, we're all very shaken up and, and you know, obviously our hearts and, and thoughts and prayers are, are with Tucker and his family. The OHL, along with an Niagara Ice Dogs have announced that they have postponed their games this weekend that were against Peterborough in Ottawa. Lindsay Dunn, City News, Toronto.